Hi, in this session we will be learning about how to use entry widgets in TK Inder. Ok, so in the initial setup I assume there is a window, there is a label, there is a button and let me show like what is my initial setup and how it will look like. So I have a title and this is my window with a label and there is a command button with a caption click me and in the label there is the name of the boss, student. So next I am going to add how to use uh, text widgets and the main difference between text widgets and uh, entry is in case of entry we will be able to get only one line of text possibly like few words but in case we want to have multi-line content to be taken from the user like address of a person or something else then it's better to go with the entry box. Sorry, uh, we have been talking about entry text box. So text widget should be used in case you are going with the multi-line inputs. Okay, let me name my object as txt. txt. Then I'm going to add this window text onto my window, and this txt to be has to be packed to load it on my screen. Okay, you can see after the command button there is a large box which is nothing but your text widget. So here I can type multiple lines but this is not possible in case of your entry box or entry widgets. So what else can be done with this text? So if you want to have some predefined content over the text widgets that is also possible. So to add that you have to use txt dot insert what you are going to insert then you have to give the content what has to be shown here okay let me give it as a hello one and i'm going to add one more statement or content insert I'm going to give this to be hello to so, then let's check okay so according to my first insert hello one is being displayed and according to this this has been inserted and as I told if you want to give additional information that can also be done or if you want to delete that is also possible so it's a, like editable or normal window as a or maybe a basic notepad where you can type in or you can delete all those things but formatting is not allowed here until and otherwise you define your program in such a way okay so what should i do if i want these things to be in a separate line similar to your uh, c or you know the new line character slash n so if i use slash n you will be getting it in uh, two different lines so next thing is like if you, if you I want some content to be displayed but that content should not be editable or it should not be deleted by any of the person. In that case you can change the state of your command button sorry, command uh, sorry text widgets state to be disabled. In by default it will be normal that is in an editable way if you want that to be disabled you have to give text.config and state to be disabled. Let's check. So now hello one and hello two are there, but I am not unable to. Actually, I am trying to type with my keyboard, it's not working. Or if I want to delete it, even that is not possible. The reason is now I have given my text widget to be in a disabled way. Of course. The default itself is normal, but just to check whether it works. So now if I want to delete or if I want to type my name, that is also possible. So sometimes if you want to have some content over this, some defined uh, way, that is also possible. So what I'm going to do is text out insert after in hello. I want to display some character over here. Okay, I will tell you. This, uh, I don't want this. What I'm going to do is text 
dot insert here what I am going to do is 1.1 comma I will tell you like what is the meaning of 1.1 okay. so what this implies is this is my line number 1 and after the first character I want to show the star I hope you can observe here what has happened so 0 so I, I will explain like how the index works so the index starts from 0 1 2 3 4 5 so totally six characters are there including space here so in the next line 0 1 2 3 4 5 so, sorry 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 so here like 5 6 7 totally seven characters and seven characters are there in each line So, if you want to have in the first line and in the first uh, index, so as I told 0 is uh, H and in first index I need to have the star. So, even this can be done. Or else, if you want to have some formatting for a specific region, that can also be done. Let us, we will see like how this can be done. So we have an option called tag add text dot tags. Okay, I'll close this. So you know like how to give this, and you know what is the meaning of this 1.1 or 2.1. So anyway, I'll show for second line also. So in the second line, so I want the start to be here 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 what I mean this 5 is after O of this one second line Let's see what happens ok now we can understand better in the first line in the first index 0 1 here star has been printed in second line 0 1 2 3 4 5 fifth index position star is being inserted from the existing content allow 1 and allow 2 respectively Okay, I will remove this now. I will show like how to add a tag. Sorry, txt dot tag underscore add. So this can be done for formatting in a specific way. So I am giving like this is my first format, and this format is meant for first starting with first line first character and it should end with fifth character 0, zero to fourth character so that is mean in first line 0 1 2 3 4 till this I want some formatting to be done ok I will tell you like what should be done just uh, listen now so what I am going to space I am going to make a format for this part alone that is from first line 0th character to 4th thing then I am going to have one more formatting for the second line let me label name this as format 2 so format 2 is meant for line number 2 that is beginning of my line number 2 till the 5th character or the 5th index next I need to specify with the option called config so now I have added the formatting I specify like for to which part this formatting is applicable now I am saying I want this format 1 so you finish <coughs> close this then I'm going to say background color to be yellow. Then I want foreground to be solid we are given yellow, so we'll try with some other contrasting color blue. So next I'm going to have <coughs> for the second uh, format. So for this, so I want to give some other different color. Let me try 
some other combination black and green So I'll again run the program. Okay. So you can see only formatting is applied for the first line, not for the second. Can you guess like what was the mistake I have done? See here I have mentioned 2.0, but instead of specifying 2.5, I mentioned 1.5, which is a mistake from my side. So I'll rectify it, and then I will. So that is the reason this formatting is not applied for the second one, second line. So now we'll check <clears throat> because I have changed to 2.5. Okay, now you can see in the first line, starting from zeroth character to fourth character, H A L L, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Before that fourth character, my background is yellow and foreground is blue. And in the second line, it the background is black color and foreground is given to be green color. So it we have given to 0 to 5. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. It, so it applies just before your fifth character. Here it's just before your fourth character. Okay. I believe that you have learned something more useful like how to use uh, text widgets and the earlier video I put out to use entry widgets so text widget is mainly used for multiple lines for getting multiple lines and if you want sticking on to the single line input you can go ahead with entry okay we'll see in the next video until then bye